Today, national progress and national prosperity are being held back chiefly because of selfishness on the part of a few. It is that attitude that leads such people to give a little thought, to give nothing but lip service to the one-third of our population that I have described as being ill-fed, ill-clad, and ill-housed. Georgia and the Lower South may just as well face facts. Most men and women who work for wages in this whole area get wages that are far too low. And when you come down to it, there is little difference between the feudal system and the fascist system. If you believe in the one, you lean toward the other. And I'm opposed to fascism as I am opposed to communism.